Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I picked up this jewel yesterday after work. It was uh, listed locally for sale. It's a 1965-110 manual lift. It's been restored years back and it still shows awesome. It's got a little bit of paint on that, uh, that floor mat I gotta get off. Yeah, they did an awesome job at it. The deck's been restored. It doesn't have all the decals. I'll probably add those later. Just the hood decals are on it. It's got all the original tires on it. An older gentleman restored this and uh, yeah, he did a great job on it. You can see it's got a couple scuffs here and there, but yeah, it's an older restoration. Got the eight horse Kohler in it. I had the, uh, it was missing the PTO cover, which I had, and it was missing the, uh, the original style muffler and I had it. So I took the, I called a, I saw it called a salt shaker muffler. I took it off. Yeah, the, the rims and tires are detailed. The deck's really nice. I've got to replace the dash panel. I'm going to get rid of that uh, amp gauge somebody hacked into it. I've got another dash panel. So that'll be the, the probably the last thing I do to it. This is going in the collection. It'll match the 64. They're in about the same condition. And the two guys that restored both these, they were best friends. So I got one from each of them. Yeah, it uh, starts up and runs great. Like a sewing machine, the deck works from kick it on. Honored to have it in the collection. This one won't go anywhere. It'll stay with my round fender collection. I've got three of them now that are completely restored. I've got to do a, uh, I've got to do a 67 110 and I'll have the whole, whole, uh, the whole collection restored. And I've got a 112 that's semi restored with a snow blower on it. Okay guys, thought I'd just give you a quick video. This one I picked up. It's getting that season. People are listing stuff again. Like I said, I like having this one in the collection. Everything's detailed. Generator's black. It should be green. But yeah, it looks good. It stands out. I may end up putting a new wheel and a uh, horn button on it since I'm not shooting for originality on this one. This is uh, 20,000, what is that? 20,068, a 20068, that's a 65, about 5,000 in on the run. 65's got the four speed transmission, like 65 through 67. It's got the shifter D10 or quadrant, whatever you want to call it. The guy actually had this listed as a 63, and I can tell by seeing the side of it what year it is. So I told him, I said, yeah, it's not a 63. His phone was blowing up. Everybody were making higher offers on it. 65 doesn't have the starburst on the uh, gin belt cover. Sub 66s don't either. And then 65 the last year for the, uh, the small hitch plate on the rear of the tractor. And then you can tell by the five lug wheels that it's a 65. And the uh, you can tell by the shift quad or not. Yeah, then he gave me the serial number and uh, knew for sure. But yeah, I told him it was a 65 before he even sent me the serial. Got some decals to put on it. I've got some extras, so this one's going to get my extra decals. Yeah, pretty cool having the original tires. Goodyear, Terra Tire. 
Same in the front. Got the diamonds. Diamonds in the back. Yeah, I always like having original tires on them. Okay, guys, that's the 1965 John Deere 110 round fender. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll have a lot more videos coming over the summer. Okay, guys, see you on the next one.